some of you might notice something slightly different about my image um not actually my face but i don't know if you can see but the background is kind of blurry and it looks like my room is kind of long and i think that's what we call depth of field and i think i have it so basically it's not my amazing camera techniques that have gotten this nice blurred out background um it is in fact this beautiful lens that i got off day for christmas um i talked about this in, that i was getting this in my christmas haul video and um it hadn't arrived yet but it arrived today so i'm really excited to use it i didn't even have to like do any setup i just popped it on the camera and bam I have a blurred out background so yeah i'm really like excited to play around with it i hope it oops kicked camera so i hope it looks good a 20 millimeter lens for anybody i'm not doing anything there it's a 20 millimeter lens for anyone that's wondering and uh, please excuse my hair basically i was going to straighten it um but then it's like four o'clock and i know the light is gonna go so i said okay do either i have nice straight hair or don't film at all so i said i'll have kind of bushy hair and i'll just film so sorry about that <laughs> I like went over really quickly with JHG, but whatever. I'm gonna get on with this haul. Basically, um, it's stuff from the sales and then some other bits and bobs that I got just right before Christmas, but didn't have time to fill my haul. So yeah, it's a mixture of sales and non-sales, but mainly sales stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna start with the non-sales stuff, I think. So I was contacted by a company called Dresslink and they asked me if I wanted to uh, pick some things out to like review and stuff and I was obviously like yes, yes I do want to do that. So yeah, um, I hadn't heard of them before they emailed me and um, I went onto their website then and I was literally like oh my god there's so much stuff on here like it's huge. But three things and it came to $20 including postage and this is from, it comes from China, I'm not sure if it's a Chinese website or what but the stuff comes from China and the sizes are like Asian sizes, definitely. Um, so yeah, they're called Dresslink. And basically I picked out three items that I'll show you now. And as I said, they're so super cheap. So I'm just gonna show you. So the first thing I picked out was this skirt. Now this is the usual um, Zara uh, skirt. It's like the, you know, the skirt style that has shorts at the back. Um, so these were like $7 or something and I was like, okay, the quality might be not good at all, but the quality is so good. It's just like the Zara ones, in my opinion, maybe let not as thick. Now I had to get a size large because on the website it said a large is an 8 to 10, which is absolutely bizarre. But um, that's what they said and that's what size I am. So that's what I got and it fit per fits perfectly. So I think like they're small as a size 4 to 6, which is absolutely tiny. So uh, keep that in mind if you do order from that. There, do go for a large if you're an 8 to 10. If you're any smaller, I'd go for a medium, of course. But yeah, so this is the score and I'm like, so happy with this for like seven dollars and it's like thick and nice and really flattering um so yeah i'm really happy with that the next thing i got was this top this is like the baseball style t-shirt and it's cropped and it has long black sleeves uh, again really nice quality really thick i got this in a large again um they actually have started doing these in american apparel the like cropped versions of the baseball top and i really liked them for ages so i saw this and i was like amazing um this was like five dollars as well it's just insane um and there's chinese writing on it so i'm not really sure what the story with that is but yeah it was amazing really thick and really really nice and then the last thing i picked out which is inside out of course um i had a couple of dollars left to spend i think so i got this t-shirt and it was it's just a stripy t-shirt and it has a nice pocket on the boob area and yeah again i got this in a large and this was i think three dollars or something again really nice soft quality like just the same as if you bought or buying a t-shirt in zara or topshop so yeah, I got those three things and including postage from China and it was $20. Like that's like 15 euro, 16 euro. So that is like ridiculous. So um, I would highly recommend you check them out. They've so much stuff and a lot of copies from like high, high street kind of shops as well. I'm gonna leave their link in the description box and yeah, so really happy with that. So just before Christmas, I got some things in American apparel and um, yeah, I'm gonna show you them obviously. So I got these uh, shorts, they're called tap shorts. They're like hound's tooth print. Uh, you can see there and they're really high-waisted oh come back and focus face they're really high-waisted and yeah that's there's no pockets or anything at the back and um, then they tie at the side these like i hadn't seen them in american apparel before i tried them on they're so so flattering they're a bit tight now i have to say after the old christmas eating but um yeah these are american apparel they're 40 euro i think and um yeah, they're just really, really flattering. So if you see these, definitely try them on. They kind of hold in your stomach and like cling onto your bum, which is what everyone wants, really. So yeah, really happy with those. 
Um, I then got this uh, school skirt, I'd say you'd call it, cheerleader style skirt. I've wanted one of these for ages. Um, and yeah, it just has the pleats and it's extremely, extremely short on. Um, yeah, so you do need to kind of wear bicycle shorts or something underneath. Um, and it's high-waisted and then just has the pleats. Um, I'm not a huge big fan of this with tights. I think it does look like genuinely I'm just going to school. But I think with in the summer with bare legs, this will be so nice. So I might just keep it until then. And that was, I think, 47 euro as well, which I think isn't bad at all for American Apparel. I also got a pair of black riding pants there, um, a new pair of those, uh, but they're in the wash, so I can't show you them. Okay, moving on to the good stuff, which is the sale. So I went in on the 27th of December. So a lot of people go in on the 26th of December. December and do their shopping then so it was a bit late on the sales but I never go in on Stephen Sayer or Boxing Day whatever you call it. It was alright, I definitely thought the stuff wasn't as cheap as it has been in previous years um, but I still did manage to get a few bits. So starting with Topshop, the first thing I got was this blazer. It's um, a cropped blazer, I don't know what these are called, like there's a name for them but it's, they don't have any buttons or anything but it is like kind of like a suit style jacket and um, I've worn this and it's a really nice deep purple um, and just I think this would be just it's, I think this is just a really handy piece to have. I never seem to have dressy jackets and stuff in my wardrobe. I think when you go sale shopping, it's good to buy pieces that you think you're gonna be able to wear with a lot of things, which I think I definitely will be with this. So yeah, it's just a suit style jacket. It has um, shoulder pads, and yeah, I just like that. I really like the color. And this was reduced from 87 to 35, so that was pretty good. I also got a pair of shorts. Um, and these are them. So they have like. Can you see the detail there? I'm just waiting for it to focus. Like sequiny details. Um, and I really like them. The only thing I don't like um, is the fact that they're black on the back. I love when like that sequiny stuff would be all over them. I think it makes them look way more expensive. So that's the only thing. It's like, yeah, half sequin, half not. But yeah, I really like them. And they're super high-waisted and they have a zip at the side. And they're really flattering and just really comfortable. Um, yeah, and these were reduced to... Like it said, they're 18 euro, which is ridiculously cheap for anything at Topshop. Reduced 18 euro. But it says, like, um, they're a concession at Topshop. So I don't know if you can see that now. It's the concession at Topshop, and it says 18 euro. But then up here, it says that they were 84 euro. Um, so I don't know what, what was going on there, because I just can't see how these would ever be 84 euro. And they're by this brand, which is, oh, what is this? I don't know, TFNC London. I have no idea what brand that is. I've never even heard of them. But yeah, so I got them and I got them in a size medium and yeah, they're pretty nice. I think. And then I got a kimono. I went into Topshop thinking I wanted to buy a kimono. I got one in the sales last year that I wear to death. So this time around I was like, I had my eye out for another one. So this is what it looks like. Oh, it's going to be so hard to show you this because it's absolutely huge. But uh, it's, a, it's this really nice thick kimono material. A lot thicker than other kimonos I have seen. How many times can I say the word kimono in one video? But yeah, so it's really shiny and this flowery print. And um, it's a typical kimono style, really long, really billowing. Essentially, it just looks like um, like a dressing gown. And yeah, that's what it looks like. But if you wear it with the right things, it is not a dressing gown, obviously. So yeah, I picked this up. Oh, I'm trying to show you. There's no buttons or anything on it. It's literally just a drapey style. It really does look like a dressing gown, but with a black dress or something, I think it'll be fine. So this was originally... 84 euro and then it went down to their now 60 euro range and then I got it for 35 euro So that was pretty good. That's all for Topshop So I went on to Zara then and again wasn't that impressed with Zara even though their sale is usually insanely good But I don't know it just wasn't that great <laughs> Maybe I'm sure maybe it's because I've just bought so much over the Christmas period that I'm just all shopped out but um I had my eye on this jumper for like since October I think and I just didn't get it and then it was on sale it was only reduced by 10 euro so it wasn't really that great a reduction but I just got it and I'm really happy I did so it's this blue fluffy cropped um jumper if you follow me on Instagram you would have seen I had this on when I was trying on my checkered black and white trousers and yeah so this is the jumper it's so fluffy and warm and cozy and yeah it has this big turtleneck um jumper on top and this was reduced from 49 to 39 so 10 euro discount not great but like oh it could be one of those things that might go down in more in the sale like keep going down and down in the coming weeks but to be honest i think people are going to actually pick these up so i decided i would just get it and i'm really happy i did because you know when you've been trying something on for weeks and you just keep thinking about it that's what happened with this yeah what so yeah, I'm glad I got this, and as I said, it was 39 euro, and they have them in 
like a lilac, a cream, a grey and a burgundy so they're all very nice. Oh I forgot to say also on Topshop I picked up a pair of earrings. Their jewellery section, their jewellery sale was actually really good but I... So I picked up these hoop earrings. Yeah basically this is the hoop earring. Ah I don't know how to use focus on this lens. <laughs> Sorry. Can you see that? If I put up clothes it just stays out of focus. Sorry guys, I'm learning this lens. I don't know what's going on here. But yeah, basically there are these little, um, oh God, what do I do? If I just move my face closer, will that work? No, okay, so there you go. Oh God, this is painful, sorry. Um, they're just hoop earrings and they're like thick, like that chain that you'd get on a necklace and stuff, but they're like that button earrings. And these are reduced from 10.50 to 6.50. So my last sale purchase um, was probably my best one because um, I got these loafers from Office. And you can see them like this. I've worn them a lot since I got them and they have the, whatever these are called. Um, so yeah, I got these from Office and basically I've had my eye on these loafers for ages, like for a year. They've just always been there and they were like 87 euro, which is too much for these. And they were reduced to 33, so I thought that was so good, like more, is that half price? Yeah, half price, less than, le more than half price. So that was really good, and they just had a size 6 and a size 7 just sitting on the rack. Tried them both on, got the 6, delighted with myself. I was like, I can't believe they have them in my size. Like, it's real weird they'd have like a size 6 in these left, because it's such a popular size. <clears throat> but yeah, so these are from Office, and they were 33 euro. And I am so happy with them. So that is everything from my post Christmas sales haul. Um, I hope you like this video. I hope you like my new lighting and my new lens and all that. Um, it is getting extremely dark now, so the lighting isn't perfect. So maybe it'll look nicer once it's a bright day. Um, but yeah, so thank you so much for watching. I will leave as many of the links as possible down below. I can't leave a link to the um, Panasonic lens because I don't know where Dave got it, but I'll ask him and if he tells me in time, I'll put it down below. And um, what else am I to say to y'all? What am I trying to say here? I hope you all had a great Christmas and why I'm out of focus. And let me know how you got on in the sales. I'm at New Year's Eve today when I'm filming this, so I hope when this goes up, you'll have all celebrated your New Year's Eve, but I hope you all had an amazing New Year's Eve. 2014 is gonna be a good year. I can feel it, it's gonna be exciting. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed my haul. Please follow me on Twitter and Instagram, which I'll leave below and please subscribe and please share this video, comment on this video and like it and all those things so other people see this video. That would be really cool. Yeah, thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye. Oh my God, look at that delicious blurred out background. Oh, it's also blurred and sexual.